Hello and welcome to Dhe IAS. Today we are diving deep into a fascinating topic that has far-reaching implications for India's national security: the role of space in defense. We'll explore how space technology can be a game changer, the challenges India faces, and the strategy it can adopt to harness the full potential of the space. So let's get started. In a world where defense relies on three pillars: observation, positioning, and communication. Space emerges as a powerful force multiplier. It provides global coverage, surveillance, rapid response, navigation precision, and seamless integration. Space technology's history dates back to World War II, when Germans fired V2 rockets over Allied territories. Today, it offers opportunities to enhance defense capabilities, making it a vital instrument of modern warfare. Now, to fully realize the potential of space in defense india must adopt a holistic approach that goes beyond the mere deployment of satellites in the orbit it necessitates the integrated development of both the ground and user segments a synergy that will facilitate the seamless fusion of technological breakthroughs yielding the desired outcomes this approach extends to the utilization of space assets not only during times of conflict but also in peace time ensuring that the nation remains prepared and resilient in the face of evolving security challenges the fusion of space and defense is a global trend that gained momentum in the recent decades india to some extent recognizes the importance of integrating space for security into its defense strategy focusing on two critical aspects enhancing combat potential through space tech and safeguarding space assets one example is deploying space based command control communication computers intelligence surveillance and reconsa c4 isr systems these systems are vital for boosting defense readiness enabling application like weather forecasting secure communications surveillance reconsa precise positioning navigation target identification and missile threat detection they can also integrate with cyberspace and artificial intelligence making every soldier a formidable part of the war machinery the ultimate potential of space in defense is the ability to win without direct combat a paradigm shift india must fully embrace it's imperative for india to enhance its state capabilities and invest in innovative technologies for both conventional and unconventional defense scenarios the nature of warfare is rapidly evolving ranging from short and intense conventional conflicts to hybrid network centric gray zone and the emerging multi domain warfare a common thread in these forms of warfare is the integration of c4 isr systems vital for expediting decision making processes in today's context space technology is advancing exponentially with breakthroughs in hypersonic glide missiles reusable launch vehicles in orbit refueling co-orbital applications iot constellations in leo the low earth orbit cis lunar explorations quantum communications multi payload constellations direct energy weapons and many more these advances are reshaping military affairs and are crucial for india to stay in the forefront of these developments to ensure its national security india faces significant challenges in fully realizing the potential of space for defense One major hurdle is integrating space technology into broader defense framework. This integration requires enhanced interagency coordination, substantial architectural reforms, a shift in the strategic outlook, and the development of phased roadmaps to guide the evolution of space capabilities for defense applications. Historically, India has followed a reactive approach, responding to external threats with incremental measures. Projects like navic the positioning navigation and timing restricted services and space based surveillance programs were initiated in response to the kargil crisis while these dual use projects are operational their strategic effectiveness has been limited due to challenges in producing high quality and high end products and lengthy gestation period in co developing user and space segments it is imperative for india to transition from this crisis driven approach to embrace 
a comprehensive planning. This includes formulating defense space guidelines, developing a doctrine, crafting a robust strategy, establishing an organizational architecture, providing technical support, and creating essential infrastructure to fully harness the potential of space and defense. A notable reality in the growing space gap between India and China is that despite both starting their space programs in 1960s, now they differ significantly in both quality and quantity of space assets. China has surged ahead, surpassing India by a considerable margin in terms of operational satellites, technological prowess, and comprehensive space infra. This growing gap is cause of concern for India. China's space achievements include rapid global scanning, sub-centimeter PNT precision, robust quantum encryption to counter jamming, and a wide array of space warfare capabilities. The stark contrast between India and China is evident in budgets, launches, research, and space prowess. This underscores the magnitude of India's challenge in the space domain. Now let's look at India's challenges and opportunities. India's approach to space technology for defense applications has historically been characterized as reactive and supportive, primarily geared towards meeting immediate defense needs and sustaining aging assets and initiatives. While this approach has not fully optimized utilization of space for defense, it has been to a certain extent justified considering the nation's socio-economic and security conditions over the years. However, it is evident that the emphasis on capacity building for defense through space has often been driven by external security threats, leading to a reactionary approach. For example, projects like NAVIC and RESART, which is used for radar imaging, were initiated primarily in response to specific security challenges. To address this issue, India needs to adopt a proactive stance necessitating comprehensive planning in terms of defense space policy guidelines, doctrines, strategy, organizational architecture, technical support, and infra development. Now let's look at what are the recent trends in the defense space organizations. Recent developments highlight the need for specialized space organizations. Major space nations like Russia, China, US, France, UK and Australia have established and enhanced their defense entities. India has recognized this trend and established Defense Space Agency under headquarters of IDS along with the Directorate of Special Projects under DRDO. These efforts show a growing commitment to developing a defense space sector and opening opportunities for private space industry since 2020. However, defining and coordinating the desired end state are crucial for optimal resource utilization. To unlock the potential of space capabilities for defense, India must adopt a multifaceted strategy. This strategy should encompass key principles such as resilience, interoperability, and flexibility in design and operations of the defense space architecture. Collaboration with strategic allies and commercial entities can further enhance India's space capabilities, aligning them with national security objectives. By capitalizing on the advancements of the commercial space economy, India can position itself as a front-runner in the rapidly maturing space domain. Now, what's the crux of all of this? The space is poised to become a pivotal element in India's defense strategy. As the theatrization of defense progresses, India must fully embrace the potential of space to fortify its national security. The multifaceted approach to defense space encompassing comprehensive planning, organizational restructuring, strategic vision, and proactive investments in the defense capabilities will pave way for India to bridge the space disparity with other major space powers. By aligning its space enterprise with the evolving landscape of modern warfare and national security needs, India can position itself as a formidable space power ready to meet the challenges of the 21st century. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you found the content insightful, do forget to like, share and subscribe for more engaging content. Till then, stay aware, stay curious.